Okay guys, so uh, my scenario is a 24 hour food recall. Um, Jake slash um, Craig is the fitness trainer and um, Melissa is the client. Uh, the scenario ugh, goes where, um, oh, I'm looking at the wrong scenario now. The gym instructor is uh, seeing the client and they have to establish that the client, um, everything that the client eats, um, the client is um, obese and sort of in denial that they have a, uh, any sort of issues with their food. So um, they've also been a little bit stuffed around with trainers, so they're a little reluctant to uh, have a bit of a good chat. Uh, over to you, Craig. Hi, welcome Melissa. Uh, I'm Craig, I'm going to be your instructor for this morning's session. I uh, understand that you're in earlier with uh, with another trainer. Yes, that's right. I just want to um, sit down and have a chat anyway before we get started and uh, do a bit of a 24-hour food recall. Just so I thought um, we can start, say, maybe looking at your diet as well as sort of what we're going to get you to do here at the gym. It, uh, it might end up speeding up you know, you meeting your goals and achieving what you want to achieve here at the gym. Does that sound all right? Yes. All right. Well, I guess if uh, we're looking at the last 24 hours, can you remember what it was that you ate, say, in the last, uh, like for breakfast and, and for dinner last, or for dinner last night and breakfast this morning? Um, dinner last night. Um, oh yeah, I had a meal, um, and then breakfast this morning I had some toast. All right, so it was, it was, was there anything else or was it just toast this morning? Uh, what did you have on the toast? And uh, did you drink coffee or juice or anything with that as well? Yes, I had, um, tea and strawberry jam on the toast and butter. Cool, thanks. That's very good. Now, getting back to, to dinner last night, you said you had a meal. Can you remember what that meal was? Was it sort of like rice or pasta or was it sort of meat and three veg uh, or a salad or something like that? Meat and three veg. Fantastic. All right, so I'll get down, uh, just writing all of this down. How often would you say you uh, you drink water? It, would it be you know, regularly throughout the day, or, or very um, sort of when you're in the gym exercising? Oh, I don't like water. Really, what do you drink primarily during the day? I guess, uh, or something that we're going to try and work on. I guess is increasing your uh, your water intake. Obviously, that's a very important part of uh, of sort of a healthy lifestyle, as well as uh, your sort of food. Nutrition. Well, I drink tea and juice and cordial and whatever, but I don't drink water very much. Okay, they all so have water in them. Yeah, I guess that's a, that's a fair point. So I guess it's it's just sort of like a taste sort of thing. You uh, you want it to sort of taste like something. Yeah. All right. Now, getting back to uh, the last 24 hours, do you know what your or have you got anything planned to uh, eat for lunch today? Did you bring lunch with you or um, anything ideas along those lines? Um, no, I haven't brought lunch with me. I'll just grab something a bit later on, I suppose. Do you do that regularly? You sort of just uh, like you know, obviously you're fairly busy and working and, and life and whatever. You just sort of duck down to. Uh, a sandwich bar or something like that. Is that sort of the case? Yeah, I don't eat lunch. So you're skipping meals too. Okay. All right. Um, getting back to last night. Uh, did you eat anything after dinner? Was there any sort of snacks during the day or, or like dessert after uh, after dinner before you went to bed? Oh, not much. About oh, eight squares of chocolate and a packet of chips. 